why is your situation so complicated and what advice and guidance you have from spirit to help you navigate this complex confusing situation okay so let's find out the why first why is there a lot of history between the two of you there is a lot of history you go back a long way i feel like this is something that's to do either with your ancestry or you've got something with someone where there's you know just a lot of a lot of history and what has happened recently to affect something from your past that you've got an energy a connection with each other through that just feels like it's disconnected which is why it's become confusing ten of wands it's exhausting there's been a lot of burdens a lot of responsibilities that I feel you've been putting on each other it almost feels like you've you've been in a situation where you have learn to depend on each other and you've lost your independence and historically there have been someone you can depend on but things have changed in a way that's become exhausting you, you're feeling burned out but guess what your connection's strong i said because you've got this past energy i'm feeling a sense that the energy the connection is really really strong and is burned out and is done in as you feel and although you feel like enough is enough it's it's just a phase but you go back a long way and I feel like there's a resolve there's a, a way that you can fix this so let's see the star healing divine timing healing okay I just feel like you are meant to learn a lesson from this okay I feel like it's been a hard difficult painful lesson but that star is telling me that it's it's going to be okay just keep the faith you know the stars all about hope faith optimism healing your star card is your wish being fulfilled as well so if it's a resolve you want you've got a really strong connection you you can get through this okay you just need to take some time out the hermit is saying go within you've got the answers within you and it's time to to do some introspection here and just figure out what you want from this and then communicate and have a conversation about how to navigate through this together to find that equal balance that compromise it's going to take a long time okay a lot longer than you wanted to it's not going to happen overnight there's a lot of history here and it's going to take some time to to mend to find a resolve but I feel like the hard work and effort will be worth it as long as you're both prepared to put the work in. So let's see what else spirit comes through with the lovers. There's definitely a choice that you're going to make here that is going to determine how your future is going to turn out together. But I feel like a, the, the, the difficulties, the challenges, the confusion or the overwhelm, it's behind you. Let's split the deck. So... If this is what you both want with the four of wands, I feel like perhaps one of you's already, you know, extended that olive branch, but one of you's kind of dismissed it and thought, no way. But it is the end of a chapter. This is death, rebirth. This is needed to happen for you to find a new way, find a new pattern, find a new chapter, find a new connection that's going to revive your, your love for each other. I feel like there's a lot of really sturdy, grounded, true, genuine feelings here. The connection feels strong. It feels like you go back a long way. That's what's coming through constantly. You go back a long way. And if this is what you both want, maybe some counselling, maybe someone who's a relationship advisor, relationship um, therapist, you, you can get through this together if that's what you both want. Because your connection it is solid it is strong and there just needs to be some compromise there needs to be that negotiation there needs to be that letting go of the past and not harboring what's happened in the past if you want a future together it's about now using the energy of the star to heal from the past and reconnect and rekindle your connection that can definitely take some time to to work through 
but the opportunity is there. So have faith. There is hope here.